know if I've ever had a sardine, but I sure don't know how to make a cute card. It looks like one. I started with three pieces of paper that are cut to three by five inches and then rounded the corners and cut a frame out of one of them with my craft knife. This little handheld craft knife is so smart. Oh, giant roll of foam tape. I put that foam tape all around one of the pieces of paper and then put the frame right on top. This is starting to look like a sardine can because we put all that tape in there and now it's got a little bit of little lift. But I just realized this is showing. So let's cover it up with a little teeny strip of paper. And it's homemade, so it's okay if it looks bad. Add some glue to the edge. It'll dry clear. So it's a little 3D can. I'm just gonna freehand cut out some sardines. This was the most fun part. I cut out some sardines from foiled silver paper, but they're missing something. Bring on the googly eyes. Obviously they need the googly eyes. I made them a little bear. And for a little more color, let's make some lemons and put them inside. We got our little sardines in the can. Now we got to make the top. So we're going to put some little zigzag cuts like you're opening the can. I'm just going to put them down the side. Yeah, that's cute. It'll... And now to add some lettering to the front. I'm no official hand letterer, but I think I did pretty good here. And that metallic gold pen around the edge. Oh, it's perfect. You need the pull tab. Put two pieces of silver cardstock to glue them together. Little details like this pull tab just make it so much more fun. And then we'll just use our favorite glue. Glue's so good, it's stuck to my pen. Almost forgot every card needs a greeting. I'm gonna put it on the inside of the can. <gasps> so cute, right? And here's the thing. Come on. It sounds like a can when you open it because of the zigzags. I'm gonna use a removable tape runner so that it will stay closed but also open easily. Let's open it one more time. 